So Ponder Point, what exactly do you do on those days where your flesh is crying out, your emotions are crying out, your mental is crying out, and you just want support? You know that your joy of the Lord is your strength. You know that he answers your needs. You know he prepares the way before you. He's got your back. But there's those days where life is just happening all around you and the enemy is absolutely having a Hail Mary party and you have to choose. Am I going to walk in fear or am I going to walk in love? Am I going to run to someone else and their um, flesh and their physical support and encouragement or am I going to run to God first? And then the support that he brings through those that he attaches or divinely connects me with that during the day, be able to um, get affirmation and encouragement from that after I get my supply from the one true source. Sounds like it would be an easy choice knowing that your strength comes from above, knowing that he knows all he knows and is preparing the way before you. He knows all the tools you have and that you need. He, um, he knows everything. He knows everything you've done in the past and loves you anyway. He knows what your choices are going to be and he loves you anyway. Um, but it's not always the easiest choice to make to go to him first because when we're having those days or those moments, we just want to reach out to someone else. They can have the sympathy. And does that really help us? Does that encourage us? Does that uplift us? Does that keep our eyes on him? Does that keep our eyes off the enemy? And does that break us from the fear? If it does, awesome and great. And you are so blessed to have people that are accountable in your life to you and to God to help keep you on the path. But if you're reaching out to people that are just going to help you stay in the comfort zone that you're at and stay in that mode of fear, then that's not a positive thing. I would adore if you'd share below or if you'd even private message me what it is. What is it that you do to help you know and to run to the one that's truly for you in every aspect of your life? I am Michelle Wynn and I'm very passionate about standing the gap from where you are to where you can and want to be. Be blessed.